Other economic news tonight. There is a new victim of the falling fortunes of the new economy. Pets.com is closing down. The demise of Pets.com is one of the first needles to punch a hole in the internet bubble. I mean, basically, you, you had a new attitude towards business. Um, people were investing in companies that, that showed promise, that didn't necessarily show revenue. Internet mania, that short-lived rush by investors to pump money into anything with a dot-com in its name and buy those companies to turn around and pour that cash into advertising. There was this whole new kind of lexicon for talking about this thing, not just in the tech world, right? You know, dot-com became part of the mainstream terminology. Pets.com will sell off the majority of its assets and lay off 255 of its 320 employees. Pets.com was one of the first e-commerce companies. We sold everything for pets from food to toys. Their business plan was to reach as many people as possible to create volume. But they were losing money on every piece of pet food they sold. Pets.com reported sales of $9.4 million. But those goods cost the company $9.6 million before expenses like marketing and administration. It wasn't about the revenue. What it was about was perception. And they, perhaps more than any other company, had a hold on perception, exemplified by this sock puppet mascot. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.